Our other top story tonight, a mother and daughter are facing charges after police say a child was hurt while at their in-home daycare in Pleasant Hill. Mike De Silva is looking into this case for us, and Mike, the mother of this child, understandably very shaken up. Absolutely. That mother says knowing the two daycare providers will finally have to pay for what they let happen is the peace that she needed. Those are her words. That mother also says this has been the most challenging month and a half she has ever experienced in her life. A Facebook post from the child's mother shows a photo of the girl's injuries. In that same post, Emily Capali writing, being a young mom is hard enough, but dealing with picking up your child and seeing her bitten, hit and bruised with no real answers as to what happened was difficult. I cannot tell you how much this has broken me. It has pushed me to levels I could never imagine dealing with. 49-year-old Cindy Marie Holt and 23-year-old Amanda May Holt are charged with child endangerment, causing bodily injury, and neglect or abandonment of a dependent person. The daycare is run out of a home at 1810 Andrews Drive in Pleasant Hill near their Copper Creek Golf Course. Before that, the two ran a daycare not far from there out of a home at 454 Edgewood Lane. The Pleasant Hill Police Department worked in conjunction with the Iowa Department of Human Services, DHS, and the Polk County Attorney's Office. DHS says child abuse assessment information is confidential under the law. Now, I did find out that in August of last year, DHS found that the child care provider was in non-compliance in several areas with mandated regulatory requirements that must be met by a registered child development home. Erin? Okay, we'll continue to follow up on this. Thanks, Mike. Sure.